So my testimony has to do with my brother. He is actually my half brother. We don't use the word half, but uh, my father divorced my mom, married his mom. So essentially we are only children, but he's my only sibling. So we, we cling to each other. And um, he was in a really bad accident last week. So uh, my aunt called me at work and said that he was in a seven car pileup. And of course, you know, I immediately went into kind of panic mode, should I leave and whatnot. And um, I finally decided, hey, why don't you text him? So I text him and um, um, out of a seven car pileup, he's still able to call me and tell me, you know, he's okay. But um, just to give you a little background, he, he's a DJ, kind of lives in DJ's life, you know, a lot of drinking, a lot of partying. Um, within the last year, he decided to become baptized and, and joined a church and has really improved his relationship with God. So I was really proud of him, you know, that he made those steps. And then, um, you know, I also cover my family in prayer. My children, you know, my mother still living, my loved ones, I always do it. And then, you know, how you get into this rhythm and you kind of fall off. But here recently, you know, I kind of got back into the mode of things. And you cannot convince me that, you know, his obedience and, you know, God hearing my prayers didn't save him because this seven car pileup that you will see pictures of, um, he came out with just a concussion. He's sore, he's bruised, but the only actual injury is a mild concussion. He was in the hospital overnight and he was released the next day. So I know for sure that it was nothing but God.